But girl, I, I, I kill them. <laughs> I do. Hello. And welcome to my chaotic existence. I'm pleased to have you. Um, and to my empty LA apartment, I have a very, very, speaking of chaotic, very chaotic moving vlog coming up next after this video. I was going to post it first, but I ended up deciding to do this video first. So I hope you're looking forward to that because girl, wow, there's tea. It's been crazy, wild. But today is a haul. I just wanted to sit down. I've been doing a lot of vlogs. I just wanted to sit down, chit chat, and show you some of the fun new things that I got for my new place. I split my time, I split my life, and I've got to split my things. And so whilst I had plenty of clothes that I could split and skincare and such, I needed to get a bunch of other things like dog bowls, oh, <laughs> like dog bowls and um, bath mats and silly things like that. So I thought I would just, I don't know, show you the things I got. I ordered tons of stuff on Amazon before we arrived. So that way, like night one, when we showed up, we had stuff, you'll see it in the vlog. And then since then, I've also like ran around to like World Market and Target and just places and picked up other bits and bobs that we needed. And obviously like this place is not gonna be fully decorated and complete probably until like the fall. And that's when you'll see a full apartment tour and whatnot. But these are just kind of some of the basics the starter pack, I literally placed an order of like 50 items on Amazon. I will have as much of this linked below as possible. Um, I literally pre-ordered like organic cotton pads for my period and organic Q-tips for makeup. And like, I I thought of like, tied, my Tide laundry detergent, my Dawn dish soap. Like I ordered everything I could have possibly thought that I, we would need. Can I tell you, I really, really appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> I did it all on my own. And I'm very proud of that. It was totally, I was like, I, I had no idea what was coming. And that's and why I, I love Amazon. Ask. I just didn't ask, it was just like, okay, let's see what comes in. And my, my mom kept being like, oh my God, we're not gonna have toilet paper. And I was like, no, 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 we have toilet paper. So like, oh, but what about, I was like, no, 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 Molly's got it. Let's dive into the doggy stuff because, um, doggy, doggy. whilst Ben Ben makes me sad, he also makes me happy, you know, I mean, he doesn't make me sad regularly. I'm just sad right now. You guys know, you, you know what's going on. We're not gonna talk about it. So look, oh my God, how stinking cute. This is a white metal tin with black accents and it says dog food on it. So obviously this is where his giblets and bits go. In case anybody's wondering, he eats salmon vet diet. The salmon keeps his fur very shiny and the vet diet is like super high quality. Oops. <laughs> there we go, I just bit. And then I ordered some of his absolute favorite these are Kong, and they're not just regular tennis balls. Oh, I just thought he was gonna come running. <laughs> oh, Molly. <laughs> Torturing yourself. Okay, it's gonna be funny. Um, he's obsessed with these, and I love them because he's the best dog I've ever had for playing fetch. Like, my family pet, my friends' dogs, my other guy dogs, nobody plays fetch like Benny. And I love these balls because I can hear where he is when he's squeaking them. So, got plenty. So hopefully he gets to come enjoy them soon. And then I ordered a ton. <laughs> like literally, okay, we've got his um, supplements. And then we've got a ton of poop bags. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many. A poop bag dispenser. There's so many poop bags. It's ridiculous. Um, oh, I miss all the pooping. <laughs> Never thought I'd miss the poop so I much. Know. Okay, and then look, look how cute. You guys know um, in BC, he has a mat like this for his food. And I love this one that I found on Amazon. It came in a bunch of different colors, but I just got black because my plan for this place is to decorate it very colorful. Like I want rainbow vomit, <laughs> color everywhere. But I'm especially going with like mustards and burnt oranges and hot pink, pink and um, red and like just like kind of warm colors. And I just didn't want to get one that might clash. So I figured his food bin is black and white and this is going to go right next to it. So, <laughs> so it's rubber. It's a bone shape. And it's a bone and it's black and has the two bowls built in that you can just 
pull out. It does come with the bowls and there's tons of different sizes. So I based the size that I ordered based on like how much food he gets fed. Ooh, next, I'm so excited. I love Sage. I've been buying stuff from Sage, God, since I was in high school. Mm -hmm. Sage is a Canadian company, but they do have stores here in LA now. Like they have one at Century City Mall, which if you're ever in LA and love shopping, you gotta hit up Century City Westfield Mall. Um, so I got a bunch of hand soaps. They're just like so aesthetic. I also got a bunch of cleaner. I'm so nervous about knocking something over because, you know, we got glass stuff here. Oops. <laughs> okay, so this is really freaking cool. I like using all natural cleaner as much as possible for laundry. I like using Tide, I'm just gonna be honest. Um, but for like hand soap, counter cleaner, kitchen sink cleaner, like all of that kind of stuff, I like to use natural products. And I've never tried the Sage Cleaner, but I really wanted to. So I just took the plunge and I did it. And I think I'm going to get it for my place in BC too. They're glass bottles. They're so beautiful. And they have this silicone on the bottom that comes in like different colors. And it says what it's for. Can you read them to us, mommy? Yes, this one is, this one is multi-surface. So it says it right there, multi-surface. And then what's this one? I'm not sure one? if you can see that. And then this one is for glass. So when you order them, um, they just come like as an empty bottle with the different oils. So I got a bathroom, a multi-purpose, and a glass cleaner. You just put a little wee bit of the oil in and then water. And then the final things that I got from Sage were some of my favorite oils. I got peppermint halo, which is great for headaches, and I got pure lavender. And I then- I should use a little bit of the peppermint now. Oh, I know, I do have a headache. I, think I, have I have literally just took an Advil. Yeah. And to go with those oils, I got two different diffusers, one for the bedroom and one for the living room. So I'll just kind of give you a peek. <laughs> I've had so many diffusers over the years and all of them have been from Sage. I don't, I don't think I've ever tried a diffuser that isn't from them. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> I can make all these noises. Which one's this one? Oh, it's lovely. It's it's gray. Is that my gray Which one? Be beautiful, yeah. yeah. So that's for the living room. And a big room. one, nice big one. Yeah, that, that's the big one that I'm gonna put on, like I'm planning in the living room to do like a shelving unit. So I'm gonna have that on the shelving unit. I actually got my editor hooked on Sage. She was just telling me that the other day. So funny. It's true. Molly got me hooked on Sage. She got me this for Christmas. It's a little pocket carrier with a bunch of essential oils in it. And I carry this with me everywhere. I literally had to take it out of my purse to film this clip. And then I got this little one that's white for the bedroom. I think Christmas around here. It does feel like Christmas. And I feel like those are gonna be really great for the vibes. It's gonna really set the mood in the space. Look at my vacuum. We love Roomba. a smooth segue. I got the Roomba. It is like a robot vacuum because between cats and dogs, there's a lot of fur happening in this place and it can be hard to just constantly need to vacuum. Um, and I have a Dyson and I adore my Dyson um, back in BC, but I just thought I'd try something new and try a little robot vacuum. And I asked on Twitter for recommendations and a couple of people said that this one connects to an app that's voiceover accessible. So I'm really hoping they were right and also that I ordered the correct one because again, I did it all by myself. It does say at the bottom, App Store, Google Play, Wi-Fi. Sounds like a- I'm so excited. And you know what's so funny? Okay, I have a blind friend and he's renovating a home at the exact same time as me. So, but I've been like a few months ahead of him on everything. And so like I told him the appliances to get, and he's like, you just saved me so much time. And then he texted me, he's like, what vacuum do you have? And I was like, oh, I just bought the um, Roomba iRobot vacuum. And he's like, okay, that's the one I was looking at buying. And I was like, yeah, I get it. So he texted me, he's like, mine came in. And I was like, so did mine. <laughs> So funny. funny. I love having a blind friend who's in the exact same era of his life as I am. That's we can amazing. just like constantly go back and forth about this. Yeah, go back. I met him at Mira. He has a Mira dog. I met him when I got Gallup and we've been friends ever since. He's like one of the coolest people I know. Well, what about your containers? Oh yeah, I went to the container store. Always a must because you know as a blind gal, I love my organization. So I got two different types. I like literally had to measure. So there's like cupboards behind me. So I measured the shelving units and these ones were the ones that fit the best. What color are they? Cream? Cream. They're cream and they're textured and each one has different things in it. So this one has 
sunglasses in it. Um, and then I got these pink ones. It's just like a pink plastic. These were like $7 each, which at the container store, things can get really expensive. So I was like, mm, I don't want to spend $26 on one basket for my closet. So I got these ones for seven bucks. They're, they're great. Pink, and I love them. Like they're perfect. They're going to be easy to keep clean. I just think they're great. They have handles, which I love. And they just slotted right into the cubbies in my closet. So each one has like you know, different, different clothes put inside. These I got on Amazon. You guys know your girl loves makeup. And so I got some makeup organization. This is a lipstick container and I like that it's like slanted downwards. Obviously I have yet to fill most of it. And by the way, I am still absolutely addicted to the Hyaluronic Happy Kiss by Charlotte Tilbury. I'm wearing it right now. You know what, I'm gonna touch up. This is the Pillow Talk shade, but I would love to get more like this is the only lip product you need in your life. I'm just saying. So I'm good. I'm feeling a lot of people are wearing that. It's a lip balm, a lip gloss, and a lipstick all in one, and I couldn't be happier. Ooh. I just choked on my own spit. Ooh, um, yes. We are, the whole plan is like to basically be able to fly back and forth with zero luggage. And so I do have to have like something of each thing here as I would there. Um, and so I have makeup brushes. I ordered um, Real Techniques and Morphe. So it's a combination of both. And this like holder that has three different sections. So I have my face brushes, my eye brushes. And then in here I have the organic Q-tips. <laughs> so ridiculous, organic cotton Q-tips. And then I have these um, mascara ones. Now these are what like a makeup artist would use to put mascara on a client. Um, but I get these to comb out my lashes um, to make sure there's no clumps after mascara and to comb my eyebrows. And then I just get rid of I use them like a couple of times before I get rid of them. Um, but they're really helpful. So I ordered a bunch of those on Amazon. Makeup brushes can get really expensive and sure, sometimes expensive makeup brushes are really nice, but you really don't need to spend a lot on makeup brushes. Like you can get great makeup brushes from brands like Morphe and Real Techniques, like in a bundle for like a really decent price. I got this little thing to store. This came in all different sizes and configurations. I got the one that has four big drawers and two little drawers. Oh, and Lord knows I ordered a bunch of my Saint Tropez Gradual Self Tanning Lotion. I gotta put some on tonight. Can't live without it. Workout stuff! I got all of this on Amazon. Um, these workout bands. I use these for the like clamshells, monster walks, things like that. You guys know I've been on my fitness game. So um, they came with mint, lavender, and pastel pink. So cute. And then I also got a yoga strap for stretching and yoga obviously. And I think it's multicolored as well. And it was really inexpensive. All of the workout stuff I got was super inexpensive. Honestly, like vast majority of the stuff I got was super inexpensive because having to get this much stuff at once to like furnish a new place from scratch is obviously a lot all at once. So I did this like as cheaply as possible. I also got this yoga mat and then it was also very well priced, but I feel like it was like eco-friendly. Like I think that's like what grew me to this one specifically and it's pink and purple. So one side's pink and one side's purple. And I also got an ab wheel and a foam roller cause girl can't go without foam rolling and it's pastel pink. I am going to be bringing a bunch of dishware from BC here next time when it's out of storage and I can like bring it with me. Um, but until then, I got, I needed all new cutlery desperately. I mean, I need new cutlery for BC too. My cutlery is, it's done. Um, but I got this when I moved to LA four and a half years ago and I just wanted it again because I'm obsessed with it. It's oil slicked cutlery. I got two sets because each came with four. So I'm setting for eight. I got them on such a good deal on Wayfair. So I love Wayfair. Check Wayfair for sales. Like they have so many good sales. These are so high quality. They're so nice. And I always get compliments from every, every, every male, my, female, yes. older, younger, doesn't matter. Anybody and everybody who comes over to eat and sees these is like, those are the coolest cutlery I've ever seen. It's so, so bizarre. Like, it's really funny, but I, I agree. Really like them. I love it, it's so unique. And then on Amazon, I ordered these. These are currently the only plates and bowls we have. They're plastic. Unfortunately, they're not dishwasher safe, but they are a bunch of fun pastel colors. Some are being washed right now. But there's small plates, large plates, and bowls. And for all of it, it came with four of each color. So 12 pieces, and I think it was $20. And, and they're, they're wonderful. And they're so cute. Like all the different pastel colors. It's just Molly's vibe. And 
I like always love to have outdoor stuff, like plastic stuff to be able to bring by the pool, like outdoors, you know, I just love it. And then I got some candles because I always like to make places like smell like home. And that was very important to me. So I got this one for my bathroom because it goes with the bathroom colors. It's orange. And as I said, I'm going for like oranges, yellows, pinks, reds, that kind of stuff. It smells so freaking good. It's, I think, coconut mango. And I got this at the World Market. Absolutely love it. And I also ordered a bunch of um, the fire lighters, like the fire lighters. I call them that too. <laughs> the flame flamethrowers. Flame 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 You're the fire lighter. Which is so funny. <laughs> They're like, you know, those lighters. It's like this. The lighters that are have that long stick. That's how I light a candle as a blind person without being scared of burning myself. And then I got the same knife set that I have for BC. I love these. It is like something like twenty dollars. This is more than yeah. It's twenty dollars for six knives, and they come in all these bright, fun colors, all these different shapes. They're so sharp, and they have knife covers on them, so I don't worry about hurting myself. Which um, careful. Yeah, look at that. Very important. Yeah. So can't recommend this set enough. They're amazing. If you want something that's cute looking, functional inexpensive and safe as a blind person and also i think if you have color perception still um all the bright colors could make it easier to find in your cabinets right. oh <laughs> okay you guys know i'm obsessed with my dyson air wrap but that that thing is so expensive and i was honestly like maybe one day i can buy a second one but that day is not today i have got way too many expenses right now in my life and i'm so fortunate to even get to do this but i'm not fortunate enough to get to buy that so not right now not today so I bought this for like 30 or $40, it's Revlon. And I know everybody talks about the Revlon round brush one, but I never use my round brush, round brush, my round brush attachment with my Dyson. I use the like flat brush and it gives you this incredible blowout. Is this 30, $40 alternative as good? No, but is it good? Yeah, this is good. Like I can definitely recommend this. It's, it's a lot slower than the Dyson, like the Dyson does it so quickly. This takes a lot longer and it doesn't give you quite as like straight and sleek a result, but for like, God, I mean, what, like a sixth of the price, this is worth it. So definitely check this out if you've ever been interested in buying the Dyson. I feel like this could give you an idea if you'd even like it. Which so. you will. I have to say. <laughs> you will. You will. It's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, I was just talking about it with a bunch of girlies earlier today, and everyone's like, oh my god, it's so good. Yes, so these are the bath mats. We got two of these. These are yellow, right? Yeah. These are mustard yellow. We got these at World Market, and they're like circular with this kind of crochet side. I absolutely love. Very well priced. I think they were like $16 or something. So good. And they're really... Maybe they even last much more. Yeah. And they're really unique, yeah. you know? And I got them at the World Market. I also got some like really cute stuff for the bathroom there as well. Um, like this other bath mat that goes for the shower. Do we have it here? Uh, oh, I can go get it. What would be roll? Yeah, okay. I think it, it says something like so clean or something like that. Fresh and clean. It says something cute and it's outside the shower. You guys, no, where are you? I'm so excited to show you this. Look how sick it came. Terrible. Okay, this is around the other way. Oh, it has the name. There. This is my Kasori kettle. And I got the one that connects to a smart app that is voiceover accessible. And you might be like, Molly, why do you need to connect a kettle to a smart app? And that's because I'm a tea addict. And tea addicts, true tea lovers, know that you cannot steep your oolong, your black, your green, or your white tea at the same temperature. And so this kettle allows you to select which temperature. It's quite wonderful, like, yeah. Here's the base, so it has like, all the different buttons Setting. for the Very different yeah. different types of tea that you want to make and so it'll boil it to the correct temperature and i as a tea lover absolutely adore that and so because i can't use the physical buttons um i can connect it to a voiceover accessible kasori app and use it and this is black it has it comes in stainless steel and black but i think the black is sleek it's like matte black yeah really and the nice. handle i love it i think i love seeing it in the morning i'm just like it's so cute it's so cute and you know what like i have um, Smeg and like Smeg is gorgeous. It's very retro looking. It's beautiful, but it's so expensive. 
And I was, again, not about to do that again. Like I'm getting the cheap alternatives to the pricey things I love. And so I wanted something that was aesthetically pleasing the way the Smeg is, but it's hard to find. Like a lot of kettles are just very generic looking. And so not only did this one fit the bill, like doing all the different tea and having a voiceover accessible app, but it's also adorable with this thin little spout and this kind of triangle shape, the matte material. So I'm obsessed with this. Now, Kasari, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I got this air fryer. This is also controlled with a smart app, Alexa capable, and the app is also voiceover accessible. So this is the same air fryer I got for my place in BC. It's nice and big. The one problem is, it came without the crisper tray. The crisper, yeah. So we have to find a way to send this back to Amazon and I've literally never returned anything to Amazon. So that should be interesting. I also got this Value Spa um, candle in the lychee set. It's this beautiful textural jar. I've had so many of these. You can reuse these jars for so many things once you're done. The lid is so beautifully textural. The smell is incredible. It's nice and big. And I ordered this ahead of time on Amazon, so that way first night here we could light it and make this place smell like every other home I've ever lived in because I've been using this candle for years. So if you want our home to smell the same, here you go. And nobody wants to smell and we all want soft skin. So I got some products from Saltaire, which is owned by one of my absolute favorite people in the world. One of my best friends, Iskra Lawrence. She's iconic, she's a queen, we all love her. And I'm so proud of her. All of these products are sustainably made. They are natural. Um, this, de this deodorant, like beautiful, tactile. It says, everybody is welcome. They have all different scents. It smells so good. And then you just pull it out and buy a refill. Incredible. And on top of all of that, these products are so well priced. The um, containers come in all different colors. So you can like match the aesthetics. I want to get the orange one um, to go with the aesthetic in the bathroom, um, but I have the purple one for now. And the body lotion and body washes, the containers are aluminum, um, which is way more sustainable and eco-friendly than plastic. It does have a pump on the top of them. Like I'm so proud of her. And the price point, $8 for deodorant refill, $10 for the original deodorant. $12 for the body lotion and body washes. Like, it's incredible. I'm so proud of her. So I had to support, I had to support the business. Okay, I got a huge, like, mixed bag of fidget toys. Um, you guys know I have anxiety and um, also being blind, I don't get a lot of um, stimulation, like visual stimulation. It's the lack of visual stimulation is why a lot of blindisms exist, like blind people rocking back and forth or moving their head. It's, it's to create stimulation because our brains are craving it. They're deprived of visual stimulation. And so for me, I found fidget toys are great for stress and anxiety, but they're also great for stimulation when my brain is craving it and needing it. So I got this mixed bag. It came with 60 fidget toys for $30, so 50 cents a toy. And then I also got a little fidget spinner set on the side. So the fidget spinner set came with um, three different shapes and they're shiny and they have poppets. Oh, so good. And then this set came with just like tons of different things. And I got like the super cute one. It has like unicorns and other unicorns. Oh, this is like my favorite one. And it has like the stringies and these rings that actually I get these from Sage too. <laughs> um, slinky, like it just has, oh, this is one of my faves. Oh God, it's good. <laughs> God, it's so good. <laughs> so um, would recommend if you are stressed, anxious, need some stimulation, would recommend. My occupational therapist had me always play with these as a kid in school, like under my desk during class to help me focus. And they're back in my life, baby, and they're here to stay. And then I had to get this iconic hair clip set, okay? I feel so proud that I found this set on Amazon a while back. It's so good, and let me tell you, friends, I love free people, and free people is one of those places where things can be like really crazy expensive or really, really fairly priced. Like, it's just all over the place, you gotta hunt. And I was there the other day looking around. I got this sweater, I really like it. I found this exact, exact claw clip. And when I say that, I don't just mean the shape. I don't just mean the texture. I don't just mean the color, the quality, the exact same. These are made by the same manufacturer. For one, they were charging $25 US. 
I get a pack of six with two different styles, like a long one and a squared one, three different neutral colors, brown, black, and nude, for like 11 bucks. Please don't buy the free people one. Buy these. Amazing, it'll be linked below. I'm obsessed. And also, I got a pair of sunglasses at free people a while ago, and I paid 25 bucks. And then I got the exact same pair on Amazon for 11. I don't know, love free people. Look at my hippo. <laughs> <laughs> Um, love free people, but I would say some of their accessories hunt on Amazon because you're welcome. I also bought just like tons of other kitchen stuff, like boring stuff like pots and pans and measuring cups and cutting boards and like, you know, the list could go on for days. But I feel like I showed you some of my favorite things that I'm most excited about. Something I wish I could show you, but I don't have it in yet, is my Nearly Naturals. I ordered a bunch of nearly naturals plants because I love having plants in the house but girl I I, I kill them <laughs> I do it's unintentional well, but I do your way yeah I travel a lot and even when I don't I can't see that they're there so I kind of forget and so and everyone has always told you people always think they're real yeah. I got one comment that was like girl I love you but I hate your fake plants and I was like you know what everybody else thinks they're real so you go water your real ones let me be with my fake ones, okay? I love my Nearly Naturals. They're such high quality. They're beautiful. So if you're ever looking for fake plants that genuinely look real and are very high quality at a pretty decent price point, again, they have a wide range of prices, but they have like every plant imaginable and like planters for them. So cute. So I got a bunch of those. If they come in before I post this, I'll put some B-roll up. But yeah, that's, uh, that's like the highlights. Oh, wait, actually, I got a bunch of my black face cloths. That's like my favorite thing ever. I get them on Amazon. It's a pack of 15 for $12 or a pack of 12 for $15, either one. Um, and I get all black ones because when I take my makeup off, they don't, it doesn't stain them. So they last forever. So I had to get a pack of those for here. And let's go into my bed to finish this video. It says my mom, does this remind you of Ben? And she was like, no. And it's, it's like everything that I think is cute. I'm like, it's like Ben, even when it's not at all. It's just cute like Ben because I miss him. So I'm just like Ben with everything that's adorable. And then I realized, no, it's not like Ben. This is fully Gallup. That's Gallup. That is so Gallup. Lying it, down sleeping. It is a napping hippo. There's never <laughs> been something. <laughs> Nothing like Ben. There's never been something more Gallup. I need to find a yeah, Ben find in a there. There must be a little Ben in there. Yeah. That's Ben. That's Ben. Sitting up all perky. Yes, that's Ben. <laughs> this is this is iconic. This yeah. is Ben and Gallop. So the Ben guys is um a pig that's like sitting up all perky, and then the Gallop is a hippo sleeping. This is iconic. What a duo. And um also in the nicest way possible, Gallop gives off the utmost your energy ever. Mm hmm Yeah. Mm -hmm. And actually, we say Ben's like piglet. Yeah. Okay, it's a few days later, but before I end this video, I want to show you a few more like bits and bobs I've grabbed. So I got these gorgeous towels. What colors are they, Mom? They are like a golden yellow, a peach, an orange, a red, gray. Very multi color. Multi. And multi textural. And then they have these like fun little fringes. Fringe at the end. And I got this is the hand towel, but I also got the full size bath towels. So you can see again the color scheme we're going with with this place. And then the bedroom, I got this from Urban Outfitters. These are the pillow shams. Um, so it's they're actually reversible, so there's like two patterns on it. But I don't know. Again, all those same warm colors. And then the the bed cover hasn't come in yet. It's back ordered, but I really hope it comes in. And then I got this from urban outfitters which is a throw blanket to go with that again pink orange floral very fun and i got a pillow cube um they actually gifted this to me they dm'd me and they're like are you a side side sleeper by chance and i was like i've literally been wanting to order a pillow cube for like a year now and they're like we're sending you one. So I'm very excited. And I will say, huge stamp of approval. I freaking love this thing. And when I got it, I had three side sleepers here with me. And I made all three of them lay on it. And all three of them were like, I'm buying it. So if you've ever wondered my passionate sleeper opinion on Pillow Cube as a side sleeper, I give the full Molly Burke stamp of approval. Obsessed. That's everything. 
And until the next video, you can click over here to check out this recent video I posted or over here to check out this one you might like. Bye guys.